Welcome back to the Famous Room channel. After Little People Big World fans watched Matt Roloff literally divide Roloff Farms with a physical wall, many were left scratching their heads. Did Naomi already sell her part of the land? Then what gives with the wall? Amy accepted Matt's buyout and had decided that she needed a new home to start her new life with fiancé Chris Merrick. Even so, she and Matt butted heads over the wall that he erected between his property and her farmhouse. Out with the old and in with the new, Matt explained to her. And this is what this wall represents. Understanding the volume of confused fans as they peppered him with questions, Matt Roloff took to Instagram Live to clear things up. Speaking to his followers, Matt confirmed that despite the buyout, Amy still has a partial stake in a portion of the farm. Amy is still undergoing the months-long process of moving out of the farmhouse. She spent so many years on Roloff Farms, it's where she raised her children, she can't just load up a car in one go. However, sooner or later, Amy will be fully moved out. At that point, Matt explained to his attentive followers, when Amy is totally uncoupled from the farmhouse, they'll reach the next stage. That means coming together to decide what to do with their last remaining piece of shared property. There are a lot of options, but the Roloffs have one goal in mind. They hope to sell the remaining land to one or more of their children, at a family discount, of course. Matt and Amy have four children – Jeremy, Zach, Molly and Jacob. All four of them are adults. However, of the kids, only two of them have ever shown even a glimmer of real interest in owning the farm. Zach and Jeremy are both interested. They're both fathers of two, and they are twins. Speaking on Instagram Live, Matt affirms that the two have expressed an interest in making the purchase. Both Zach and Jeremy regularly help out on the farm, which makes this seem like a viable path for either brother or for both of them. As Matt notes, Zach and Jeremy could buy the parcel from their parents individually or together. The proud father and grandfather explains that his sons will have to come to an agreement on that subject. They still have time to do so, but he hopes that they can reach a decision soon. Matt definitely has a dream for Roloff Farms. The ultimate scenario for me is that the twins would take over the farm and work together, Matt expresses. He does, however, take pride in his own farm management, and he seems to doubt that anyone can live up to the standards that he has set. But, he notes, nobody likes to run that pumpkin patch like I do. We think that we can guess how Amy might respond to that last line. There are, of course, multiple ways of running a pumpkin patch. We're sure that either of the role of twins or both will do an admirable job. Let's hope that the discount is steep, however. Jeremy and Zach both have multiple mouths to feed. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.